Uh, you want to get into rating this thing? Label branding. Uh, wood cork, automatic A. It matches the straight bourbon, and then they kind of daz- bedazzled it up a little bit. Uh, that's gold, correct? Or is it a copper? It's a, it's more of a copper to match the inside color of the bourbon. Which I do like. Um, so I'm going to... And it's limited. Okay, limited, yeah, limited. I like so how it says limited release on the yep, thing. They note that on the, the paper that wraps the cork, <clears throat> essentially. I'm gonna and go it's perforated. That's a big deal. I'm going to go A++. Okay, I will go A++, too. The back of it says, At Hartman's Distilling, we believe in fine spirits have the power to turn back the clock, reclaim memories of long summer days, never long enough sunsets, and loved ones gathered on the front porch with your favorite Hartman's product. Slow down, drink up. Full and robust, this bourbon is hand-bottled straight from the barrels, uncut and unfiltered in its most natural state. After selecting our finest weeded and rye bourbon barrels, each were carefully blended together, creating a perfect blend of... Because Mike yelled at me last time. Uh, visit our tasting room in Buffalo, New York, or learn more at hartmansdistilling.com. What he's not saying is the tasting notes and the aroma. Correct. Because that's our job. So, I mean... Nose. So A plus plus for the A plus plus. So I agree. I agree. I agree. I agree. I agree. agree. Nose. You're getting a lot of wood sugar, a lot of honey, faint little bit of vanilla, and I'm getting kind of like a, a candied caramel. I do get candied caramel. I agree with you there. What's interesting with this... I feel like this one nostril is just straight ethanol. Like, really? Way more than another. I was literally going to say the exact opposite. With it being such a high proof, I expected to not smell that much, and both of my nostrils are getting a ton of caramel. Like, this is... This doesn't scream, I'm over 110 proof. Well, it I doesn't. slept in Sam's, like, stomach last night, so... And I'm allergic to dogs. So I like give myself hay fever every day. So I, I don't think my nose is as exfoliated as yours. But yeah, th- this is all fresh oak, wood sugar, and a salted caramel. That's what I'm getting on this. Or yeah, like a salted roasted caramel. I'm with you. I agree. I agree. I agree. I agree. A plus. Yeah, A plus for sure. Initial taste. Candied sugar, wood sugar, burnt toast, like toasted toast, if that makes sense. A mm-hmm. little bit of butter. Toasted bread. Yep, toasted bread. Thank you. Toasted toast. What, what do you put in the toaster? <laughs> <laughs> that bread is so good. Toast it again. So the you do get a little bit of butter on the initial taste. Um, and it's for as hot as it is, it's such a high hug. It's really like at the base. It's in between a, a high and a medium hug, but it's it's re- it's just right here in the throat, and it's soothing. It warms. It's like oh, what's grandmama's like recipe to fix me? Because I don't feel good. It's like drink this and you'll be fine. Yeah. And then it just sits in your chest in a nice warming way, and it doesn't bother your stomach at all. It dissipates yeah. right in your chest. It's it, great. It doesn't burn in your chest. It no. just keeps it warm. Yep. <clears throat> This is a man's man's bourbon, and it's unbelievable. I'm going A+. Plus. I have no issues with this at all. I'm getting a little toffee. That was my ending note, hmm. but that's that's all I got. Yeah. A+, plus, you said? Yeah. Yeah, I'm down with that. I agree, I agree, I agree. I agree, I agree, I agree. All right, ending note. Let me guess, toffee? Yes, toffee. You can faintly pick that up in the nose, but it, it's also because I just took a sip, too. This does linger, and it doesn't necessarily travel through your nasal cavity in a way like others have, where they're really, really dynamic. However, this does, it doesn't like burn your nose. It just kind of sits in your nose when you smell it. That's really good. Yeah, ending note, I'm getting... A lot of that baking spice on the end. So on the end, I'm getting caramel, toffee, and baking spice. 
I'm with you. I agree. I agree. I agree. I agree. I agree. This is a very traditional tasting bourbon, but everything is like better. Like it, take your typical it's ex- bourbon, exemplified, and just exponentially grow those flavor notes in a high proof bourbon that doesn't burn. It's just like the perfect formula mm-hmm. for a like a typical barrel proof bourbon. Yeah, I like this a lot. Yeah, me too. This is very delicious. Any note A plus. I agree. I agree. I agree. I agree. I agree. I agree. And like you were saying. I kept trying to get down how long it lingers, but I kept ruining it by taking another sip because I like it so much. But after that last sip, I can still feel like oil all around my mouth. Mm -hmm. It's just coated everywhere. You still get that lingering wood sugar, and it's just lasting forever, which might be that toasted process too. I love toasted barrels. This makes me happy. Final rating? Three, two, one. (laughs) 